Now, Action 10 Sonia Hill with your Doppler 10 weather forecast. Howdy, South Texas. Happy Thursday to you all. I hope you're having a fantastic evening. Well, last night we saw some severe weather here in the coastal bend. Taking a look at the storm reports here around Corpus Christi, we saw damaging winds and some tree damage. Our friends out in Jim Wells County even saw some hail. Meanwhile, our friends in the northeastern part of the viewing area even saw some tornadic activity that left damage behind in its wake. But the radar now is pretty quiet, but the good news is that with these storms we saw last night, we also saw some rain, which we really needed here in the coastal bend. The rainfall totals, most of us saw at least tenth of an inch of rain. Most of us here in Corpus Christi, that's what we saw. Meanwhile, some of us even saw an inch, some isolated areas highlighted in the yellow, even saw closer to two inches of rain just last night. But the state of Texas, we've been seeing severe weather for the last few days. Now that weather has moved east and we are being left with calmer conditions across the state. But right now in downtown Corpus Christi, mostly cloudy skies are sitting at a warm 83 degrees. Humidity is much lower than it has been these last few days and winds are light blowing in the southwest currently at six miles per hour. Let's go and take a live look outside. And even though we are seeing some sunshine, we are seeing mostly cloudy skies, but definitely an improvement from what we saw even just yesterday. But the temperatures today still very warm here in Corpus Christi. 84 was our high foul furious back in the 90s on this Thursday with a high of 90 degrees, 87 in Orange Grove and 85 degrees up in Beeville. But the temperatures across the state quite a range here. Here in South Texas, very warm. Most of us are in the 70s or 80s. Meanwhile, in the central part of the state, low 80s and 70s, Amarillo and the northern part of the state, the Panhandle, much milder, currently seeing temperatures in the 60s. But looking ahead at tonight, we're going to drop to about 60 degrees. Expect mostly clear skies and cooler temperatures tonight. The winds will be very light out of the north northeast, only up to about 10 miles per hour. And looking ahead at tomorrow and thank goodness it's almost Friday. It's going to be another very nice day, partly cloudy and breezy for our Friday with a high of 79 degrees. The winds will be on the east northeast blowing up to about 20 miles per hour. Now breaking down what's sure to be a spectacular Friday, 7 a.m. partly cloudy and cool, noon breezy and warmer, and then 5 p.m. mostly clear and breezy. And now it's time for your seven day forecast made possible by our friends at AutoNation. AutoNation has a huge haul of trucks and SUVs all on sale right now. Visit their website AutoNation.com. Now breaking down the seven day forecast tomorrow, partly cloudy and warm Saturday looking fantastic. Easter Sunday, partly cloudy and warm as well. Monday, mostly cloudy Tuesday and Wednesday isolated showers. Weak front is coming in Wednesday, leaving us with slightly cooler conditions.